Coming into Wednesday's matchup against Sam Houston State, Bobby Hurley was a bit shaky. This was a dangerous game. I was very concerned coming into this game, considering the, uh, the injury. Despite not having key members of its front court, Arizona State wiped away Hurley's woes. With scrappy defensive deflections, that opened floodgates for transition scoring, producing a 78-61 blowout of the Bearcats. To be just completely honest, I mean, they looked more like a, like a, a power conference team in warm-ups than, than we did, you know, but we compensated for not having, you know, that, that girth in the inside with just like a lot of will and, and athletic ability. So it was, uh, it was good to see the guys play, you know, with that type of energy on defense. Frankie Collins, the nation's leader in steals, helmed the defensive domination with three swipes that set up his teammates and himself to score, posting 12 points and a game-high seven assists. On the other end, it was the Jose Perez party. The grad transfer poured in a season-high 24 points to pace ASU to victory. It's just, that's just my natural game. That's a unique game. I don't know where I got it from. I think it's a New York play style. And I feel like my teammates just trust me to make the right plays down the end. Amidst the slew of injuries that have hit ASU's roster, true freshmen Braylon Green and Akil Watson have had to take up larger responsibilities. The pair of young devils have inserted themselves like Cinderella's foot into a glass slipper, perfectly fitting in the flow of the game. Credit our bench for going out. We got two freshmen that, that play hard, they listen, they go in, they play their role, they compete, and they, uh, they're they doing really well, and I think they're going to help us. And, you know, we got a good starting five. And, and just, just keep playing as a team and keep getting better every day. And that's just going to keep helping us. Shout out to the freshmen. They're playing yeah. hard. Yeah, shout out to them. ASU will keep ramping up for its revenge rematch on Sunday against San Francisco, a team that handed the Sun Devils their largest loss last season. From Tempe, Blake Neiman, Truckite Sports.